and another one bites the dust. The Patriots released veteran wide receiver Kenny Britt on Wednesday after suffering a hamstring injury in June that kept him at limited participation throughout training camp. Britt, 29, originally signed with New England in December. Cutting Britt adds to the Patriots' curious carousel of moves this offseason, including the release of Super Bowl 51 hero Malcolm Mitchell, who helped New England overcome a 28-3 deficit over Atlanta two years ago. They also released Jordan Matthews after signing him this offseason. The trio were battling various injuries but were expected to have impacts, particularly given the players around them. The Patriots did end former Jets star Eric Decker to a one-year deal earlier this month, as quarterback Tom Brady's favorite target, Julian Edelman, will be sidelined serving a four-game suspension at the start of the season. Following a so-so year with the Titans in 2017, which included 54 catches for 563 yards and one touchdown, Decker is off to a bit of a rough start in New England, dropping passes at camp. I mean, there's no excuse for it, said the 31-year-old receiver, according to Boston's Wee. It's something I've obviously got to address, and that's something you work through. In my mind, that's why God created practice. It's just to be able to get better and try to flush that out. But my job is to catch the football, so I've got to do better in that field. Although Decker feels more comfortable with the playbook, he knows actions speak louder than words when it comes to Bill Belichick's Patriot way. I've just got to be able to get on the field and execute and just be able to kind of not think about things and just react. I'm getting there, he said. Decker will have another shot to prove his worth Friday night when the Patriots face the Panthers. Chris Hogan and Corderell Patterson are the expected starters ahead of Decker right now, but there are still two weeks until the season starts, 